Okay, hi everyone. Just got this in the mail. I'm ready to open it up. This is my first order from Watches of Maple. It is uh, delivered all the way from London. And uh, let's see what's inside. I tell you guys what the model is. Sent from London about a week ago. Considering that the current pandemic, the current situation globally, with uh, most countries on lockdown, I was quite impressed that it arrived very quickly. Not the fastest, but uh, the ways I expected to do it. Nicely packed, lots of uh, protective, uh, we call it the peanuts. And let's just put this aside and go straight to the wood. Just be careful not to spill it all over. There's a nice smell. It's a very, very nicely packed by uh, what is on the First time buying a watch online from another country. And uh, after doing some intensive research, what is on the seems to have quite a good review. So, here we go. Nice box, the Omega, it's a brand new one, so I expect it to be brand new. it the coffin box well I wouldn't exactly call it that but I'm sure it does look like a coffin very nicely padded I'm quite surprised I actually think that uh, Omega makes better boxes than Rolexes okay, so let's just look at what's in the box it's the Omega booklet International warranty card. Uh, well, nothing to hide here. Pictograms, the chronometer certification. quality box, uh, very solid, feels quite heavy and the moment of truth it's kind of tighter, seems to be locked oh, sorry, I'm supposed to push this here it is the Omega Seamaster 300M Chronograph. This is the two-tone version. It's uh, 
Steel and uh, Omega set my go. Let's uh, first see what's in the box. Okay, oh, okay. Got a nice pouch. What's this? Probably for transporting the watch. Little drawer here. Just to pull it up. I don't think so. Nothing here. Um, well, nothing much here. This bag. Anything above here? No, that's just a Rolex thing. Very nicely padded. Very cushiony. And uh, okay, let's jump to the watch. It's still wrapped, so it may look a little fuzzy. But hey, let's unwrap it. Oh, there's a little tag down here. It's a prize. It's uh, written here. Let me try to focus. 9,200 euros. 9,200 euros. It's about. Well, you do the math. So I got my gloves on, don't want to leave smudges all over. Comes with a nice uh, rubber band. Gold is really subtle. It's not in your face kind of gold. It's more of a red gold, copper gold, I don't know. It's Omega set my gold, but it's very very discreet. And I love how the uh, gold hands, minute hour, second hands and chrono hands gives a little extra color pop to the black background. A 17 and a half centimeters wrist, and uh, it's good. This watch is uh, 44 millimeters by 17 millimeters, and it feels very solid and heavy, though, as compared to the uh, 
submarine hunk that I was wearing earlier. Lovely watch. 